Hello lovelies, how are we all today? So I have an art journal video for you today using some of my awesome scrap FX goodies. So I'm only doing a single page today because I really like this this page on the left and I wanted to keep it. I don't know what I'll do with it, but anyway. Um, I'm working in my Ed Sheeran altered art journal book thing that I've had for a while now. And I really do like the pages with the, the text on them because I feel it just, it gives me, you know, a base layer, something to start with. So I'm using some Zoe Illusions paints and these are the old ones. And as you can see, um, my favorite color, Cherry Pie, has in fact dried up a little bit. So I thought by putting it on my brayer, I might be able to get some paint on the page. I didn't really like it, but then by getting a wet one and then just using that to smear the paint around, it's sort of... Um, filled in those white areas and spread the paint a lot thinner and I really like how that looked but then I went in um, even though it's pretty much solid or well, not really solid it's it's firm but I can still use it um, when my dilutions get to this point um, I use my fingers a lot so I'll stick my fingers in it's sort of like um, a lipstick texture and then I'll swipe that on the page as well so nothing goes to waste because I will still use that until it is rock hard and then I've just added some depth in that color around the page. So now I'm using some of my favorite Scrap FX stamps. And when I really want a, a nice solid stamped image, I'll use paint rather than ink. Uh, it's my go-to. So I'll get um, some black paint on a brayer and then just spread it around. Maybe I should try this with other colors. Like my go-to is black and white. We should try other colors. But yeah, so I'm just building up textures in my background so now i've got some black paint left this is just a good old spatula it's one of my favorite tools and i'm just because like i said nothing goes to waste i'm just applying a bit of black to my page but i didn't want too much because i really liked the colors i had going on and then i'm using my brayer to spread them around you'll see i get a wet wipe and wipe up some of the black that i don't like and then because i've got more paint i'm just going to find a random page and smush that around um this is what I do with a lot of my paint when it's left over. I'll find a random page in a book, one of my other journals or something, and then just slap it down. Nothing goes to waste, and it's um, starting basically another page somewhere later on in the journal. So yeah, nothing goes to waste. <laughs> now, I really wanted a focal image. I loved those queens, but it was really big, and I really liked this background, so I didn't want to take up too much of the background. And um, I really like the queens too. I want to find something big and bold to use them on. So I didn't want it to get washed away with all my dark background. So I decided to go through and through my stash and find something else. And I found, which I've actually had for a while, but I've been hoarding them. These are the Funky Folk Snarky by Michelle Logan. And I thought, hmm, this might be, um, this might work. And I've picked the, I picked this one. It's, I love the contrast so that not a lot of the colors are similar in my background and my funky folk, but you know, that's a good thing because you can see my funky folk. <laughs> so I've used some contrast and I've stuck that one down and then I'm just going to use my Stabilo or pencil to uh, outline that because I just really love adding a bit of a shadow. And then I was trying to find some words to write and on the same funky folk, um, uh, page there was this really quote the really cool quote said this to steep d self stay strong i didn't want to cut it out but i thought i would add that because um you know i think it's it's a good little quote and kind of fitting at the moment i'm <laughs> i've been miserable the past few days third trimester it's yeah anyway i thought this was just a really good um a really good reminder on this page so i decided to actually write it i haven't written anything um, on my pages in a while I tend to use um, quotes or something like sticker quotes but I really like that I've added my own handwriting to this so yeah anyway thanks for watching I hope you have enjoyed the video and I'll be back real soon bye for now